Hi everyone, this is Arun Reddy here. Welcome to my YouTube channel Arun Reddy Tech for you. And our today's topic is SQL view. So let us see what is this SQL view. And if you are new to my video and if you want to learn DBMS, you can go through my channel playlist. In channel playlist, you will find a DBMS playlist. Okay, where remaining videos are available. And if you want to learn in Telugu, there is also a DBMS in Telugu folder where remaining videos are available. Okay. And if you don't want to miss my video, please subscribe my channel and don't forget to like and share my videos. And if you want a video before videos and after videos, you can also go through the video file description where remaining videos links are available. Okay. So let us move to the topic. So our topic is SQL view. Okay. So in SQL, a view is virtual table what is view it's a virtual table based on result set on sql statement so based on sql statement we will we can create a view so remember view is virtual table that means it doesn't exist really okay so view contains rows and columns just like a real table so it looks like real table it's it it will also contain some rows and columns but it is not a real table okay a field in a view are fields from one or more real tables in a database so what it will do it will take different uh, fields from the different tables and it will show as a single unit right okay so let us see how this will work okay so in the sql view first let us start with creating then updating then deleting and next one is a view on multiple tables okay so let us start first okay so first creating view so you can easily create a view in sql uh, query language by using create view so what we use create view okay just like create table create view okay so you can create a view from a single table or multiple uh, multiple tables okay so you can create a view on single table or multiple tables so first let us start with a single table then we'll move to the multiple tables okay so see syntax to create single uh, view from single table so single table right okay so what we'll do just we'll give a name create view view name okay so here we are going to view name as so what we'll do we'll just select some column from the other tables and we'll uh, create as another name okay just like save as we do in the ms world okay so create view view name as select column one column two so on from table where condition so let me give you example for example already there is a student table from that you want only two columns so what you'll do and you want to name that as a student view from student table i want to take two columns and i want to uh, give a name as student view so what you'll do create view student view as select student name comma percentage from student table so let us see uh, how it will work in the oracle okay so you can see uh, there's a table here okay now i want only two columns student name and percentage for example i have to display the uh, whole uh, list admission list but i don't want to show the fee paid so what i will do i will create another view based on student name and percentage see how to create create view student view as what which columns select student name percentage from which table student table right see when i say select uh, stick from student view see now i have created view so anybody can see this and uh, now my fee paid column is safe okay it will be hidden and it will be confidential right so like this we can create a view view is again it is attached to the original table so any update uh, done in the student table will affect here for example if i insert a insert a row 105 uh, some ajay some percentage some fee paid if i entered another row automatically appears in the view also okay so view is connected to the original table and any changes done in the original table will reflect on the view right okay now update okay so can we update yes we can update uh, by using uh, uh, so uh, we can update the view also so how we can also modify existing data and insert new records into a view in a sql so what i am saying not update only not only update suppose if you want to insert you can do it okay so in which in view so let us see how it will work okay for example uh, update uh, syntax for uh, update view name set column is equal to value where condition for example already a, a student there is a student list in that i uh, have wrongly entered 85 percentage now i want to change it as 95 so what i will do update student view set percentage is equal to 95 where student name is equal to suresh so let us see in, in the program how we can do it okay so you can see here there is a table already okay so what i have done update students view set percentage is equal to 95 where student name is equal to suresh so now suresh see you can see here suresh, uh, suresh percentage is 85 right 
now when i do this automatically it will update into 95 see select asterisk from student view see suresh what is that 95 right so uh, this is how we can update okay so even view cannot be yeah, view can also be updated right can we delete or drop the view yes of course we can drop the view so deleting away we can delete view using drop drop view command okay so for example sorry for syntax drop view view name example drop view student view so let us see in the uh, program so you can see here there's a table so what i will do i'll just say drop view student drop view student so what it is saying view dropped okay let us check see what i've done select asterisk from student view that automatically it is showing error why it is showing error because table or view doesn't exist nice right so this is how we can create update and delete now the till now we have only learned about the single table suppose if you want to create a view on multiple tables yes you can do okay for example see there is a a and b table and we want to select data from both of the table for that we can create a view fetching records easily so uh, both the tables also we can take some columns and we can uh, make it as a single view okay let me show uh, show you a syntax okay syntax create view view name as select so table one column column one table one column two table two column one table two column two like that okay from from table one table two if you have only two if you have more table one comma table two comma table three so okay so where condition okay whatever your condition you want to give you can do okay so example see create view emp department so i want to join two tables emp and department so what i have done emp underscore department as select emp id emp name and department d name so what i have done in from employee i am taking two columns and department i am taking one column and joining okay just like joins okay from emp comma department where emp dot did equal to department dot did so let me show you example how it will work you can see there is employee table and there is a department table right so employee table and department table now i want to join employee num employee number employee name and department name three columns and i want to create a separate a view so for that what we will do see create view emp the name new name i am giving depart because i am joining two tables so i have said employee dot department as select employee number comma employee dot e name comma department dot d name so i have selected these three columns so from which tables from emp table and department table what is the condition where employee department id equals to department d id okay so if anything not uh, sorry it is checking see it will it will match the both okay where condition it is matching both so if the, what is the result see employee number employee name and uh, you can see department name okay for example wherever it is 10 it is showing finance 20 marketing 30 sales see okay so this is how we can create uh, the create view on multiple tables nice right so friends hope you have uh, understood the video and uh, if you like the video please do like okay so a lot of a lot of people are viewing the videos but they are not liking please do like so it will help me and encourage me thank you